Um, and just to wrap up the last video, I was talking about the state thing, then there was this perp, then she, I don't know where she just burst out and say, I'm 15 years old. And <laughs> I remember this, this person, um, she was by herself and she was talking to her earpiece and she was sitting across me. I'm like looking at her, I was like, this person, is, what, what a weird, like, what a like, like clown. Right, I'm. I'm looking at. She's a, like. She's trying to get attention. She's just, you know, before she bursts out, and they're like, "Oh, you see, you're eyeing her." Oh, like I was interesting her. I was like, "Oh, no!" Can you imagine? You are on a date. It's a paint and drink date. Everybody's has a couple or drinking. You have this person sitting across you, talking to somebody uh, on the uh, on, on the. Uh, she has like a earpiece or something. Like, uh, and she's just talking randomly and she's like, yeah, I'm, I'm doing it. And I'm looking at her, I was like, what is this? What a weird, and you know, she's just there to uh, agitate you, right? It's, and you look at her across, like, what a weird, what a clown. Obviously, you know that she's there to uh, annoy you, right? And now they're just like, no, you're just looking at her because you're interested. She's like, oh gosh, she was so annoying. And I think in her mind, she's like, oh, he's looking at me. He's like, oh, he must be interested in me. No, you are just a weirdo talking to somebody by yourself. Everybody else is on a date. You're just like randomly like just sitting there talking to your earpiece. <laughs> and they're like, oh, no, you're just eyeing her. You wanted her. She was the most annoying person. But you got to understand, this is how they create this reality. It's so sad. Because this trust have to delude themselves into that level. And then you hear this person say, uh, uh, oh my gosh, this is guilt-free. I was like, listen, I don't care. Like, this perps, I don't care if they feel guilty for what they're doing. I, I'm not here to make them feel guilty. That's not my, my position. That's not my job. But I'm just, my job is to make sure that you know what you are and how illogical you are. Now, if you feel guilty or not, that's all on, on you. I don't care. You're just the bottom feeder in this. I just want you to see yourself for what you are. Don't feel guilty if you don't want to. I'm, I'm, I don't care about that. Would it change anything here? Oh, I'm feeling guilty, but I'm doing it. Don't. And they're like, oh, I'm so fearful. And I'm like, this is the most like coward-like individuals on earth. Coward-like. Like this cowardness in this, what they do. They come up with storylines and creations and manipulation and want to leave off this BS that they've created. So... They try to intimidate you in the nonsensicalness, in the stupidity, in these narrations of things they've just manipulated. And they came and say the name of somebody, an actual pedophile. These people are filled with pedophiles and they just out here trying to make you, oh, you, you eyed her. You mean the random weird person sitting across me who was talking to her earpiece she by herself in a place where we all have a date, we all have a drink. She's by herself talking from me, just making noise and weird things, start singing to herself, doing all this thing to get attention. She, these people are delusional. And also then after she said, oh my gosh, the perception changed. It's like, oh, sad piece. So to all my target individuals, these people, are they live a, a, in the reality they've created in your head in the manipulation they've created they've done they they are they, they they need people who can just escape from the real world reality and accept this falsification of reality they've created in your head and because they want to do that to make you believe these things make sense and they're like our oh, pedos like stop it stop it you guys are the pedos you want to create, and then they try to say, oh, no, we, you, you know, it's like, you're still going to get told. No, listen, I'm not saying that, thinking that's going to change anything. It's because I don't want the people who are involved in this thinking and living in that delusional world. Because when the things come back to them, I want them to understand the, the, the sources. You know, you claim to be gods and all that. I want to be, the, remember, okay, oh, it's happening to me. Oh, why, why me, God? Why did I? Oh yes, I did call myself gods a few times. Yes, I, I did. I did. I did try to manipulate somebody in these disturbing pedophilia ways. I did manipulate. Oh, I, I did change narration. I did stimulate him like this. I did like. I did, I did work in a program to try to change somebody in these pedophilia ways. Okay, I understand. That, that makes sense. That's why. Okay. Well, he suffered.
so i guess you know it makes sense you know so that's why i'm doing this to all my target individual these people are just the bottom fillers do not subscribe to these things the way they manipulate your brain and, and change it and create these memories and create these versions of reality these people will just do whatever they can to try to make you accept this pedophilia um, uh, persona when from somebody that you that that you like oh she's just agitating me it's just annoying like just annoying person and all of a sudden because she say her age was 15 years old and they want to pay me as a pedophile all the stimulations all the perception changes from this annoying per perp that you're like oh my gosh you know, just such a, a clown like straight up like i'm that's what i want to say this clown just annoying to now oh my gosh oh wow all this feeling and sensations from this clown to something else just annoying and try to give me stimulations and now they're like in my head, trying to make you feel nervous. But oh, you see now, but you didn't guess her. Right? It's like, listen, I guessed that she was a clown, annoying crap. That's it. The day I don't need to guess anything else. After that, it was all the stimulation, the sensation. Looking, I was like, oh gosh. Now I'm forced to see her in a different way. Now they make me look at her in a, in a stimulated way. It's just you're just trash. I, you know, like I, you, they, they, you, 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 I just see these people like for people who can, who wants you to accept in a reality that's not true. And so now the, my memories, my perception, all of that's gonna change. Even worse than the real, the, the reality. That's why, even even worse than in real time. That's why uh, I, I I need to take pictures because in my head they try to change it. It's like whatever they're putting everything possible. Do you understand? A person comes to a paint and drink date. And this is not like the, the time, like it's a Friday, Saturday night, right? It's, it started at six, seven. Everybody has a couple, everybody has a drink. <coughs> so she comes in this environment. So you already know like, okay, why would just randomly come by yourself? If you want to learn how to paint on a Friday, Saturday night, don't you like, like this is, it's kind of weird, right? So you come in an environment where it's, adult based right we're all gonna drink we're all gonna enjoy ourselves then you come i'm looking at her like this annoying crap like she's by herself like oh and when she came by herself I was like oh my gosh this this annoying and then you look at her it's like oh this is, I, I, she just want to and then, and then she just give her name her age out of nowhere oh my god i'm like oh how annoying is this trash and now they're like oh but you didn't guess her age what the f and then when she says her name her age sorry my date who's a perp too it's like oh look at her look at her and i, I tell her do you know she's 15 years old because i know what's gonna happen they're gonna mess with my perception i say like oh you, you deserve it you understand and all throughout the night after that she's trying to get seen by me because they want to be seen and create those perceptions so to all target individuals they have no shame these people are not here to find out who you are. They're trying to paint you in something else. They're trying to change you in something else. These people are not uh, investigating. These people are manipulating. These people are the pedophiles that are threats to children, but they are trying to turn you into one. They have no shame. Can you imagine somebody said they're eyeing you? Ugh. It's like no, no, sorry, you're eyeing her, eyeing her. I'm like, oh gosh, sad, trash, so pathetic. And then they use this tone of voice to just sound like, oh my gosh, you see, does it not make sense? No, with me, I'm here to help them understand what they're part of. Now, my brain is is manipulating. Honestly, I don't associate myself with what's going on in my brain. I've understood that this is no longer for me to. This is, it's not in my controls. This system, this technology will surpass anybody's brain who take over it. There's nothing I can do. These people, they don't have problem living in the fantasy of their own creations. They have no problem with that, but I'm not gonna let them live the fantasy, I know. It's like I live, I'm not even, like it's not even my brain. It's just like, it's, this is how things would have been if I was me, because this is no longer me. This is what they control. This is what this technology is about. This is why they do all this noise campaign and, and try to intimidate you. That's why these people in the hallway try to get you to accept these things. They know me. It's like this annoying. I was about to like she was she, like it's those people that can just like oh you just want to throw something at her. You just like oh god it's annoying like just annoying like I, like the definition of annoyance when you 
And now suddenly she's her age. Oh, this changes. So to all my target individuals, do not subscribe. They want you to be a pedophile. They are the pedophiles. And they will want to manipulate you to think in these pedophile ways. So to all TIs, understand their agenda is to make you forget who you really are. Do whatever you can to not do that. Because they're going to take over and they're really going to try to make you accept their fantasies. It's their fantasies. It's their wishful dreams. It's not the real world. You know, there are too much testimonies of what they do. And they all systematically do the perfect type of torture. You know, these people are not here to analyze you. So when they tell you, no, they are this proof because, you know, not trash. Uh, you are working day in and day out to try to make me accept this. Your job is to, quote, unquote, win, which is easy because my brain is for you to manipulate. So, yes, there are ways to, you can manipulate the perceptions. And you have been doing that since August 19, 2019 in different circumstances. So stay strong and understand these people have no shame.